Hey, what's going on? I'm Sam with Rococo, and I wanted to hop on and share five things I'm super excited about for the new Rococo Coil Pro. If you don't know what the Coil Pro is, it's our new EMF-based motion capture hardware device. It's coming out soon, and you can find out more information at rococo.com. So we're still finishing up development of the coil, so you may see a couple quirks here and there, but it has been a blast to play around with. Okay, let's check it out. So the first thing I'm excited about is just an improvement in general mocap accuracy. Because the coil is able to tell where my hands are in absolute space, I can do things like clap and my hands won't intersect. Interacting with digital objects especially usually requires a ton of motion capture editing and requires a level of fidelity that the coil is finally going to be able to deliver. The second thing I'm pumped for is using two-handed props. Again, with inertial motion capture, you typically have issues with your hands being in the exact right spot, which means more cleanup and post. Here you can see me working with a pistol, playing around with a two-handed rifle, and then also using some two-handed melee weapons. And in each scenario, my hands are in the correct spot, which means that if I have to do any editing in post, it will be a lot less than what it's traditionally been. Number three is the fact that you can use the coil without a suit and just the gloves. This was never possible before with the smart gloves because without the coil, the gloves can only track their rotation in space, but not their absolute position in space. So this is really awesome because it opens up a bunch of interesting new workflows that don't involve a smart suit at all. A great example of this would be something like a VTuber. You could set up an IK system for your character in Unity or Unreal, and when you play games, you'll actually be able to hold the controller correctly. Number four is live musical performances. So not only will the coil allow you to have accurate hand placement when using instruments or DJing equipment or whatever it is, but the coil will also prevent global drift over time. Because the coil knows where your gloves are, we can extrapolate out where your suit should be and prevent that drift. Live performance has always been slightly difficult with inertial mocap, but the coil should make these workflows much more robust. And of course, the highly accurate hand placement will be perfect for gamified scenarios and scenes where you're actually interacting with digital instruments in real time. Finally, I'm excited about multi-actor interaction. So again, this has always been difficult when using inertial motion capture alone and typically requires a ton of cleanup to make sure your digital actors are in the right place and hitting their marks. With the coil, a lot of that's going to be taken care of when you actually record your mocap. So just a quick little video, just wanted to share some things I'm excited about as we get closer to releasing the coil into the wild. Again, if you wanna know more, check out rococo.com. We have a whole info page and we did an initial explainer video about the coil when we announced it. Stay tuned to our channels for lots more coil content coming soon. We'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.